So hey guys, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the channel. I've been thinking about you all day. You have been on my mind. So, how are you? How have you been? You could talk to me. Don't be shy, I'm listening. In today's video, we're going to be doing a tuna noodle casserole. This is definitely a comfort food. When you eat this, you want to sit in front of the TV with your shoes off, your favorite TV show on, a big glass of Kool-Aid, and don't bother me, please. If this is your first time, welcome. And you are new here, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, let's get started. Y'all ready? We're gonna start off by preheating our oven to 375 degrees. Okay, I've got my water salted and already boiling. We filled a very large pot with water and we added two tablespoons of salt. We're gonna be using about 12 ounces of egg noodles and we're gonna cook that until al dente. I love that word, al dente. Isn't that sexy? Say it, al dente, al dente. Al dente. In a medium saucepan on medium heat, we're gonna add in about three tablespoons of butter, real butter. We're gonna melt that and keep stirring so it won't burn. At this time, we're gonna add in about a half a cup of diced onion with a pinch of salt. Cook until translucent. Let's add in three tablespoons of all-purpose flour. We're making a roux. We're gonna constantly stir and we're gonna cook that for about three minutes. Our heat is still on medium. After three minutes, we're gonna add in four cups of cold milk. We're gonna mix this well. Hot brew, cold milk means no lumps. Okay, now we're gonna whisk until we get a beautiful smooth texture. We did grate about one cup of white cheddar cheese. After we turn the fire off, then we're going to be adding in our white cheddar cheese. This white cheddar cheese is going to make it so creamy. This very simple white sauce is so easy to make. It's so smooth and so creamy and so delicious. We're going to be using some saltine crackers as our topping. This makes a delicious topping. Okay, our al dente noodles are ready. We're gonna be adding in about 15 ounces of tuna, adding one cup of frozen thaw drained peas, adding the delicious creamy white sauce we just made. I'm gonna go change my shirt. Number one, it's hot. And number two, I don't wanna get food on it. I'll be right back. Okay guys, we're gonna mix all this goodness together mix very well make sure each noodle is coated i've already buttered my 9 by 13 casserole dish and we're just going to pour that in and spread it out evenly we're going to make our topping at this time with one cup of saltine crackers crushed one cup of grated parmesan cheese adding olive oil we're going to mix that all together until it resembles wet sand we're gonna make it rain by putting all our topping all over this casserole. Spread it out very even. And it should look something like this. After cooking 50 to 55 minutes, this is what it looks like. After letting it sit for 10 minutes before cutting, this is the best part right here, the taste test. It's so yummy, it's so delicious. I love peas, the white sauce is so it's so good guys and it's not too much like soupy it's so delicious i love it you guys know i had to make cornbread and as always thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up it encourages me to make more videos see you in the next one